In this question, we have been given the power series of two function f of x has the power series 2 plus 5x plus 4x square plus 3x cube and so on. Whereas g of x has the power series representation 6 plus 25x plus 43x square plus 52x cube and so on. We have to find what is the coefficient when we divide these two okay and let's say h of x is equals to g of x divided by f of x which is given to be c naught plus c1 x c2 x square and so on we have to find out the value to find the coefficients c naught c1 c2 and c3 okay so let us see how can we do this since we have this h of x multiplied with f of x will give you g of x okay so we can use that property and h of x is given to be c naught plus c1 x c2 x square plus c3 x cube and so on multiplied with f of x which is 2 plus 5 x plus 4 x square and so on this is equals to g of x which is 6 plus 25 x plus 43 x square plus 52 x cube and so on okay so we'll just multiply and then we compare the terms so two times of c naught we get first okay then c naught multiplied with this term what i'm going to get it will be 5 c naught times of x then 4 c naught times x square and then 3 is the next term 3 x cube here okay so i will get 3 c naught x cube correct so this is what i will get with c naught and then i will multiply with c1 so i will get 2 c1 x plus 5 c1 x square plus 4 c1 x cube and so on correct then i will write the coefficient with c2 so i will get 2 c2 x square plus 5 c2 x cube and so on similarly i will write with c3 as well so i will get 2 c3 x cube plus 5 c3 x raised to 4 and so on and right hand side we are having this 6 plus 25 x plus 43 x square plus 52 x cube and so on correct now let us see how can we do this so what's the next step so just compare the coefficient so comparing the coefficient let us see what we are going to get so this will give us if i compare the constant i will get 2 c naught here that is the only constant and on the right hand side it is 6 so i get c naught equal to 3 so this is my one coefficient now compare the coefficient of x so i have this 5 c naught x plus 2 c1 here so it will be 2 c1 equals to the right hand side i have 25 so from this i can get 5 times of c naught is 3 plus 2 c1 equals to 25 this will give me 25 minus 15 is 10 so i will get c1 value to be equal to 5 similarly if i compare the coefficient of x square okay so what i have on the left hand side is 4 c naught plus 5 c1 plus 2 c2 and this is given to be equal to 43 now i know the value of c naught and c1 so 4 c naught will become 12 plus 5 c1 is 25 plus 2 times of c2 equals to 43 so this will implies that the value of c2 will be what 25 plus 12 is equal to 37 43 minus 37 is 4 correct and divided by 2 this is what i am going to get sorry here it will be 43 minus 37 is 6 divided by 2 so this is nothing but equal to 3 so i am getting c naught value to be equal to 3 now we'll compare the coefficient of x cube correct 
so here i am having 3c0 plus 4c1 correct 3c0 plus 4c1 then i have 5c2 and 2 times of c3 this is what i have and on the right hand side the coefficient is given to be 52 now let us see how can we do this so the next step is to put all the values so 3c0 means 9 4c1 is 4 times 5 which is 20 5c2 that is 15 plus twice of c3 equals to 52 so this will imply is 29 5 is 34 and this will be on the left hand side we have constant 44 so 2 c3 equals to 52 minus 44 is 8 so this will implies value of c3 comes out to be equal to 